Next, on extreme modeling, itinerant hobbyist attempts to highlight for the first time ever using refractive green, reflective, and ivory. And on the heels of Tabletop Gamer's awesome 6 mil video, he tried, oh, wrong, and fail. All right, let's try that again. It was then that he realized that it wasn't refractive green, that's the base of the U.S. models, but itinerant realized, oh yes, it's brown violet. So mix brown violet with ivory, and you get that, which is a little closer to a highlight of that than that other concoction you'd come that itinerant had come up with, which was refractive green and ivory. That just didn't work out too well. So let's try that. All right. Now on extreme modeling, can he highlight while filming? Of course, the problem is you won't be able to tell the difference on this camera. As good as this iPhone camera is, you won't be able to tell. That's not bad. You know, it can be a little cartoonish. It's okay. Actually, I kind of like the look of that. It looks a little extreme, kind of like some of those... No, I can't do that. Man, sorry about that. Oh, I just said sorry. I told Tabletop Gamer not to apologize for his work. You know, you're just doing what you're doing. We're not pros here. If we had full camera setups, I still wouldn't apologize. Whatever, dude. It's a hobby. We're having fun with this. Whoa, whoa. I saw a Beast of War video where he's painting some heavy gear blitz. I, I, I think I would like to get into heavy gear blitz. Maybe, kind of. You know, it's one of those games like, yeah, if I had like, a couple extra mil laying around... I might get into it. But the models are so fiddly looking. You know, I don't know, but just watching guys build them. And then the guy on Beast of War, I thought, these guys aren't going to be objective. Boom, he said, these are really hard to build. And this is a guy that does it, right? I mean, this is a guy that's good at it. I'm like, ugh. But it's so cool to hear him do that. And he's, he's, he, his name's Romain or Roman. Oh, my goodness. He was, he was great, you know? He just was real. You kind of sat there and kind of hum and hawed and and beast of war, man. They do some good, they do some good videos. And I was like, this guy's great. You know, he didn't apologize for what's going on. So don't apologize for your work. That's my rant of the day. We're just having a fun time here. All right. I was gonna say, I was gonna say something. Oh yeah. So tabletop gamer, golly, dude. Twenty minutes of. Showing how to paint 6 mil, that's great, because there's not enough videos on there how to do that. So that's what inspired me to do this here. I don't know if it's helping, but it's, you know, to start. Of course, I really need a better, I need better lighting and all that to really show it what it's doing. I really like the way this is looking. I've, this is the first time I've washed it first and then highlighted. You're probably thinking, uh, hello. Duh. To say some of us takes a while. Some of us are slow learners. Oh, yeah. Oh. Mmm, <sighs> beautiful. Oh, yeah. That's good stuff. I love the priest. I can't wait to put it in the game. I just want to go roll some dice. Bam! And the final job. Boy, look at that. Look at that highlighting. Oh, it's amazing. I don't know what that accent was. But anyway, uh, so there you go. Six mil, baby. Yeah. Um, let me think here. I know. Your dog eats lead minis.